Your Excellency President Yoon Song Yeol, my fellow ministers, distinguished guests, ladies and gentlemen. It is indeed a great pleasure for me to welcome all of you to the Third Summit for Democracy. The Republic of Korea is privileged to co-host the inaugural day of this summit together with Ecuador, the United Kingdom, and the United States. The presence of numerous high-level officials today so signifies our collective res resolve to strengthen democracy globally. It would be remiss of me not to recognize the representatives of civil society, private sector, and academia present here today. After all, strengthening democracy is a multi-stakeholder endeavor, and I extend my special thanks to the platform for the engagement of civil society for their tireless preparation for this summit. Distinguished guests and ladies and gentlemen, we are gathered here today at a defining moment in our history. At a time when geopolitical tensions are escalating, our world is witnessing a retreat from de democratic values, which in turn reshapes the international landscape in profound ways. The breakneck speed of technological innovation is adding another layer of complexity to this dynamic. The convergence of these developments will significantly influence the legacy we pass on to future generations, a legacy that will be shaped by our collective response to the challenges of today. In particular, the interplay of AI and digital technologies with democracy presents both unparalleled opportunities and formidable challenges. While these technologies enhance democratic engagement, they also amplify threats of misinformation, disinformation, and digital surveillance undermining the very foundations of democratic societies. It is now upon us to steer this technological revolution in a way that upholds and promotes democratic values for the benefit of generations to come. This effort calls for collaboration on an unprecedented scale, drawing together governments, international organizations, civil society, private sector, and especially our youth, the agent of change and innovation. Catalyzing such global and multi-stakeholder partnerships is precisely what this Summit for Democracy will be doing over the next three days. As President Yoon stated on his first day in office, human history shows that where political freedom reigns supreme, their prosperity flourished. Peace is guaranteed when countries that value freedom and human rights come together as one. Korea's own journey is a living testament to this truth. Our story showcases the political, economic, and cultural potential that is unleashed when embracing the ideas of freedom, human rights, and the rule of law. As Korea aspires to become a global pivotal state, we are committed to standing in solidarity with the international community to safeguard and advance these values. This is why Korea has decided to host the third summit for democracy. I'm confident that our, collective, our deliberations over the coming three days will harness our collective wisdom to shape a lasting democratic legacy for future generations. Thank you very much indeed.